What's up guys, Daniel Jeffries here. Thank you for joining me on another one of my videos. Today we're gonna to be going over the finale of my six character fan art challenge that I've been doing over the past two other videos. Uh, if you remember, in the, my first video, we went over Terminator and Boba Fett, followed by Agent Scully and Gandalf in the next video. And today, we're gonna to be going over the final two windows. And although I couldn't get everybody's suggestion, especially some last minute entries, I do appreciate them all. And I wanna just let you guys know that they were awesome suggestions nonetheless. So let's go ahead and get started. This first suggestion comes from Charles over on my Art of Daniel Jeffries Facebook page. Now typically, how this project has been going was I was drawing whenever I had some spare time trying to get the windows done, but this time I wanted to do things a little bit different. I set aside the right amount of time that I would need in order to, in one session, do one window per session. What this meant was that I did this window entirely at once and the other one the next day. And overall, it ended up being about six and a half hours of work. That six and a half hours obviously here is sped up to about three minutes combined between both sessions. Now I feel like if you've grown up over the past few decades, you definitely would have to know who this is. I really don't feel like there's much mystery. This of course is one of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, and this one is Raphael. This next character suggestion also comes from the Art of Daniel Jeffries Facebook page. Uh, this one was suggested by Kenna. Now, there are two different very distinct versions of this character, and I decided to go with the one that I felt was more recognizable for the general audience. Although, don't get me wrong, I like both depictions of the character, and what was actually contemplating for a while which one to go with because I liked both in different ways. In comparison to the previous window, I took a little bit more time on this one just because I kind of got lost in some of the detail and really wanted to make the background seem like water. That I, whenever I felt like, oh yeah, that looks like water, I would look back a couple minutes later and be like, no, it doesn't. And I try to change the levels and the balances of the color until I was happy with it, which I ended up in the end being. Out of all the suggested characters that I drew, I feel like this one is the most obscure, or at least the most uh, difficult one to immediately know who it was that I was drawing. So um, if you were able to guess, then congratulations. This is Abe Sapien from the Hellboy franchise. Specifically, the version of Abe that was presented in the Guillermo del Toro Hellboy movies. So that's it for this project. It was a lot of fun to do, especially this last session. Uh, I really enjoyed doing some more creature-esque looking characters. Overall, I really enjoyed the project. I liked being able to try to come up with a way to have each character break their window in some way by having something pop out. Thanks again to all of you for your suggestions on what characters to put into this project. I'm sorry to those who didn't get their character in, even though some of them were really hard choices because I wanted to draw those characters. I just felt like maybe it wasn't a character that people might know, perhaps. Anyway, if you did enjoy this video and this series, let me know. Hit that like button, subscribe, you know, the typical YouTube stuff. Also, check out some of my other videos, and I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. This has been Daniel Jeffries. Have a good one.